Okay, looks like everything's good. Uh, wait, where's the thing? Thing. Uh, there we go. Okay. Ha! Welcome, one and all. Navigator EX here in a little bit of Final Fantasy... Mmm... Seven. Let's go with that. Wow, my brain is not working today. Where is my tea? And my coffee. My coffee's in my stomach. I know exactly where that is. <laughs> oh, God. It's gonna be one of those days, isn't it? Ugh. Mmm. Oh god, that tastes so bad. Uh, whatever. Waste not, want not. Anywho, where were we last week? Oh, well, I got my finger right on it, basically. Last week got Vincent. That is literally all I can remember. Um, I think there was some Vincent and some wandering around. Eh, something like that. Let's go! Because I, I don't know what the hell. Uh, oh, right. And uh, Sephiroth uh, going to somewhere. Okay. I hope this was the somewhere. Um. Oh, right. All the stupid parts are coming back to me. So, yeah, there was the single crusher as he flew out of the mansion. And what is the green thing? I guess the green thing's my ride. Um. And he said he was going north of the Nibble area. And then I had to backtrack and make sure that I actually saved that. Oh, wow. Which, as it turns out, I actually did save shortly after that before going on the quest for Vincent because I'm a dumbass and I, I missed parts. Ah, oh, boy. What is this? What is this? Oh, oh. That looks like a leaning tower of rocket that's huh we already with sid now well shit might be getting some plot what's that oh looks safe A rusty old rocket? I wonder why they'd make something that huge for. Mmm, deterrence? Hmm. Okay, we got all these little red arrows. All these things to explore. Fun! Wonderful! At least I don't have to worry about trash bag dudes littering the, the streets. And what we got? Also, yeah, what, what do we have? Oh, Money-wise. Okay, cloud... Got no MP on anyone, except for Vincent, who I've barely used. Oh god, I saw that and immediately thought of Green Herb. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wrong game. A gun is a man's weapon. Ain't nothing else will do. Oh, we got the weapon shop. Neat. Okay, so Vincent. Shotgun. Oh, we got uh, upgrades for just about everyone. Okay. Where are we at? Shotgun for... Vincent gold armlets I can afford 14 of those I should be able to sling it I don't care where we at yeah let's uh let's do that why did I say 14 seven of those oh I'm thinking the monetary value of them okay gold armlets cool this first thing you walk into town I'm uh, not going to do like yesterday with that Armored Core Verdict Today stream where um, yeah, the first 30, 40 minutes were just set up. Oh my god, I'm so sorry about that. That's that's not a good feeling. Is that the Mona Lisa right, right there in front of that? That looks like the Mona Lisa. Really pixelated Mona Lisa. Real or fake? Okay, Shanghai Inn. Wait. Holy shit. We got like a South Korea and a Shanghai in here. Cool. But but not the, the same Shanghai though, so you know, it's a little different. It's a little different. Okay, oh. Man, I would have been happier with the dollar. But mm, I already committed to the bit. Let's take a little bit more tea here. Uh 
it's a little bit terrible because of the cough drop that um, preceded it uh, didn't quite mix. Okay, something to drink. Oh boy, we're getting a let me hear your story bit again. You meet the captain already? He's the, really the town's representative, so you should really talk with him. Oh boy. They're already pushing me toward the captain. Oh, I think I know what the uh, answer here is going to be. Yeah, someone is in there. Okay. Saw the dude moving. What we got? Okay, these are the in rooms. Mm, controls! Oh, man. Another really, really nice, quiet day at work, but uh, on the way home from work, I had to quickly throw my... Uh... Oh, how's, how's, how to put it? Uh, so yeah, Ubisoft is doing a streaming thing right now, and uh, Ubisoft Forward, I think, is what they're calling it. Oh, some neurotic dude. So I had to try and watch a minute of that in order to earn a free copy of Watch Dogs 2. So here's hoping you out there in internet land watching this managed to get in on that while it's uh, available. Uh, hopefully it's still available at the, if you're watching live now. Uh... Doesn't look like something I'll play, but hey, now I might have the option. I don't know. The login servers were borked. It, I got logged out and had to restart and couldn't log back in. But let's see what this guy's deal is. Mm, I'm so bored. Isn't there anything that can get me excited? Um. Hmm. Is Viagra for pre pre prescription? Um. Let's see. Maybe knitting is more his thing. Oh, it's just... Jeez, it's boring! Is, and isn't anything exciting gonna happen right around here? Okay, this is starting to remind me of a bit from, I think the cartoon was Extravaganza, where a dude was always saying nothing ever happens in this town, and just all the stuff was happening, like right behind him, all the explosions and bus crashes and such. is dumb. It was great, though. Uh, Captain. Okay. Hmm. Okay, yeah. Captain would be expressing interest in this town, but, you know. Clouds a dick! Did you see a man in a black cape? Man in a black cape? Nope. Don't know anything about it. Who's the... Who's the captain? Well, I guess he's not that much of a dick. Aw. Captain was a pilot when Shinra was still interested in their space program? Mmm, Palmer. He was going to be the world's first astronaut, but there was an accident. Ever since then, he's been wasting his life away here dreaming about going into outer space. Hmm. Got some astronaut farmer goodness here. I need to turn down my system volume a tad. Because I'm blowing out my ears. Uh, and I value my hearing. It's how I hear things. Item shop. Okay, neat. Got anything here that doesn't suck? I potions need those. Huh? Oh! Shit! Uh, looks like I have something to grind for. Hmm. Don't know what exit magic is, but if I had to guess... Running, but easier. Uh-huh. Time magic. Hmm. I don't know how useful that is in this game. But I only have 8,000, so... I think I might have to lay off of that one, because I really need those high potions. Just... I get wailed on, and I'm, I'm not great at healing. Probably because I have the ATB up so fast. But, you know... I wouldn't want it to be too easy. Oh, here's a person. Gaze at that rocket. Oh, boy. I'm assuming your Gramps isn't the captain, but, you know, I could be wrong. Ah, oh, man, Ubisoft. See, I'm trying to think of something nice to say about them, because I don't... I actually don't hate them, but 
I don't really play anything that they do. Okay. Leaning Rocket Shinra's number 26. All right. As a matter of fact, the last thing of Ubi's that I recall playing was uh, the first Watch Dogs, and the game seemed all right, PC version, to be honest. And, um, yeah, it, it ran okay. Um, but more importantly, because the, the driving was kind of meh, I'm not really great at driving in the first place, but this just felt kind of kind of weird. Um, the protagonist was a shitbag, so I couldn't get into it. It's like everyone around him is is just so much better than than Aiden. Aiden's just such an asshole. Let's see, do I know any good jokes? No, and don't even try. Never try. It's one of life's most valuable lessons. Ooh, a box. Power source. Man, some of the items in these games, it's like you have to wonder, you know, how many of these things they're just laying around. It's like, how are these people using some of these things? Are these people using some of these things? Like, what the hell kind of world is it like where you just you can find a chunk of materia sitting around? It's like, what happens when a when a kid gets his hand on like some like gravity material or some shit? What's up? What's up with that? Drill arm. Oh, we we go in Mega Man. Oh wait. Hmm. Well, I guess not because Barrett's not here. Ah, well. Might as well. Gold armlet for all. Oh wait. I didn't even look at the stats, but whatever. It's good. Oh god, I need to put that on on someone. Uh, be good on a healer. Yeah, let's uh, knock that off him so I can put on someone with heals. He's got strength. Tifa, she gets it. Uh, let's see. Power soul. Wait. Holy crap, I have two upgrades for her and I haven't... What the hell? Oh, growth rates. Interesting. Interesting. Might be worth a downgrade. But not yet. Peacemaker... Oh, that's a little sharp drop in the attack percent. That's... Mm. Let's go with a shotgun. Oh, right. Carbon bangle. Yeah, that's everyone in the party for the moment. But it's like, yeah, I don't... Okay. Which way is this? Oh, cutscenes. All right, hold that thought on the materia thing. Because I wasn't actually anticipating starting plot yet. There's a Shinra logo on it. Tiny Bronco. Huh, this is cool. Want me to keep watch? Oh, um, man. Oh, shh. Oh. Can I help you? Uh, no. We're, uh, we're just looking at it. If you would like to use it, please ask the captain. The captain should be in the rocket. I'm Shara, and what are your names? I'm Cloud. Vincent, my occupation is... Forget it. Tifa, nice to meet you. Hmm. So you're not with the Shinra. I thought the approval for the reopening of the space program came. Huh? President Rufus is scheduled to come here. The captain's been so restless all morning. Rufus? <sighs> a little trick on your cloud. This is just a little, little jumpy. One more. Hmm. All right. Now the tea doesn't taste quite so terrible. Wee. Uh, okay. The captain's up in the rocket. Okay, oh. I didn't even pay any attention to whose house this was. I mean, look at all this cool shit. So, whatever the hell this is, looks like some sort of... Looks like a vehicle, looks like a car of some kind. I don't know. Two-seater. Uh... 
Also, how does he, how do you get it out? I would have to see the, this place from the outside because it doesn't look like there's a visible exit for it. Not indoors. Oh, I see it. I see the garage right there. That's cool. Uh, but yeah, kids. Like, I don't know how material works in this world. I need to look that up at some point, but it's like, you see it slotted into weapons. It's like, what would a child have to slot materia in? I'm sitting here imagining some kid with like a Tonka truck and, you know, just putting a lightning materia in the back of it. And then all of a sudden, you know, pyrotechnics and the old suckers just barbecued all of his friends. Actually, it doesn't sound half bad. Shit, I always had to like lightning material when I was a kid. Could have powered my Game Boy without burning double A's out the ass. Four double A's in a damn Game Boy. It's like I'm trying to remember how many of the Game Gear used because I never owned one of those. Oh, that was just a big old circle. I'm probably wrong about this. I want to say it was six. I want to say it was six for the uh, Game Gear. I mean, holy shit. I, I would have loved a Game Gear at the time, but you know was not meant to be, I don't I don't believe. Ah, here we go. Up, up, get up there. Climbing action! Oh. And there's Shinra with a hyphen again. Shinra, type 26. Also, the rocket looks a lot more. Oh, and there's a mirrored type 26 up in the top right. Ah, neat. I don't usually notice little details like that on account of, you know, I'm blitzing through things and I just, I don't know, oh, whoa, it's kind of, it's like he was levitating there for a second. Oh boy, here we go. Uh, one moment, one moment. All right. What are you guys doing in here? You heard the captain was here. Captain! I'm the captain! I mean, I know it's probably gonna get copyright claimed on YouTube, but this is the best damn music. I don't give a shit. I just kinda gotta listen to this for a second. Uh, a couple of them. Videos got copyright claimed. I don't. I don't give a shit about copyright claims. I don't really make money off it. It's like it's a nothing gesture to me. It's like, as long as they're not making strikes, we're golden. Oh man, he has the most badass theme. I love this theme. Got like just a little bit of the snares in the back. It's just that kind of almost military punch. Which I suppose helps with the captain thing. This part, though, with the uh, the trumpet, I suppose, it does sound a little bit Sega Genesis. This and G Genesis, though, it sounds it reminds me a little bit of the uh, God, what's it? That airplane zone where you're on the airplane in Sonic Two. Eh, I don't know. Name Sid. Everyone calls me a captain, though. What do you want? Okay, Rocket, Rufus, and can we borrow the tiny Bronco? <laughs> yeah, it's like, hey, person I just met, can I can I borrow your plane? I I cannot possibly think of a single reality in which this goes well. <laughs> you out of your damn mind? That's my most cherished possession. I can't let you take it. <laughs> That's actually kind of tamer than I expected. What do you want? All right, let's see. Rocket. Wow, not bad for a kid. All right, then I'll explain it to you. You know, Shinra developed a lot of technological gadgets during the meaningless war, right? That's a Mako company. In the old days, it was a weapon manufacturer. Well, they came up with a rocket engine. There was so much excitement about the thought of going in outer space. Our, themes got, our dreams got bigger and bigger. We put a major budget into it, made a prototype after prototype. Finally, they completed Shinra number 26. They chose the best pilot in Shinra. No, in the world, me. I mean, come on. <laughs> Finally, 
We get to the day of the launch. Everything was going well. Because of that dumbass sheriff, the launch got messed up. That's why they became so anal. So, Shinra nixed it out of space, space exploration plans after they told me how the future of space was space exploration and got my damn hopes up. Damn them. Oh man, this is a guy with some spirit. Then, he was all over once they found out Mako Energy was profitable. They didn't even so much as look at space exploration. Money, Moolah De Niro, my dream was just a financial number for them. I was weeping into his arm there a little bit. I almost didn't notice. Look at this arrested rocket. I'm supposed to be the first man in space with this. Every day, it tilts a little bit more. At this rate, I don't know which, which will come first. Is the thing falling down or me getting out of here? My last hope is to talk to the president. Neat. Okay, what's next? Okay. I guess he's stuck on that note. Ah, oh, boy. Eh, boy. Where are we going? So I guess it's about time for Rufus to show up. Ah, so... His... His, his endpoints, he sees, are, be, are getting out of this, this town or the rocket falling on him, right? I mean... <laughs> rocket falling on him okay i mean because that's basically where i was going with it it's like you know why not kill two birds with one stone rocket falls on you you're not in this town anymore can't really leave but you know you don't have to be here weirdly enough ah uh, the thing that strikes me as odd is it what like what efforts were made to straighten the rocket i mean even because look at look at how it leans there. That's leaning into the town. I'm I'm assuming that Shinra wasn't so irresponsible as to leave the fuel in the thing, whatever fuel it's filled with. I don't know shit. It could be like mako or, or liquefied pork chops. I don't know what the hell I got. Hmm. <laughs> Tea's gone. So you know why waste all that uh, fun juice on some little town? Shit. Uh, at least I wouldn't. Unless it was liquefied pork chops. Damn it, I want pork chops. Ah, uh, then I'd have to cook. What kind of chump cooks for themselves? Excuse me, Cloud? Oh. Did the captain say anything? Nope. Oh. Oh, boy. Damn it, Sheriff! What, are you blind? We got some guests. Get some tea, damn it! I, I'm sorry. Really, don't mind us. Shut up! Sit your ass down in that chair and drink your goddamn tea! <laughs> oh, man. Ah, uh, damn, I'm pissed! Sure, I'll be in the backyard tuning up my tiny Bronco. Make sure to serve them some tea, I'm all right. Man. Make his a decaf. A decaf, uh, wait. Uh, put a sedative in there too. Vincent has nothing to say. Sorry, it's our fault. No, 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 he's always, he's always like this. Is it always like this? She literally just answered that, Tifa. Why is Sid so hard on you? No, it's because of my stupid mistake. I was the one who destroyed his dream. What happened? Hey, get your ass in gear. You work like a snail. Even the moon, even the moon get tired waiting around for your ass. I, I'm sorry. Don't take so much time checking that damn oxygen tank. Sure, being careful is good, but it won't do any good no matter how many times you check that oxygen tank. That thing wouldn't break even if hell froze over. But, no buts. You're not stupid, so be more efficient. 
I I'm sorry. Captain, our dreams are finally coming true. We're so proud to be a part of the launch of Shinra number 26. Captain, prepare. Our preparations are complete. All that's left for living is liftoff. The word salad, the bordering on word salad, is just going to be a thing lately. I don't want to tell the dealers. Yeah, leave it all on me. I'll be back in a few. Salutes and everything. All right, Captain, fly our dreams in outer space. Thanks, guys. Praying for your safety. Instrument panel all clear. Shinron number 26 ready for launch. Engine pressure rising. Engine pressure rising. Shinron number 26, three minutes to launch. Beginning countdown. Finally. What the... What happened? Sid, we have an emergency situation. A mechanic is still in the engine section of a rocket. What? what who is the little shit? I don't know. Activating the intercom in the engine section. Hey, God damn it! Hear that? Hell still in there! It's, it's Shira, Captain. Don't mind me. Go ahead with the launch. So what the hell are you still doing in there? I was still concerned. The results of the oxygen tank test weren't satisfactory. You stupid little bitch! This is gonna get so hot in there, there ain't gonna be shit left when we blast off! You gonna get burnt to a crisp, you're gonna die! You know that, don't you? I don't... I don't mind. If I can just fix this, the launch will be a success. I'm almost done. This is a real charm, ain't he? Almost done? You're gonna die! Dude, we must start the countdown. We won't make it if we don't. Starting engine. Hey, wait a minute, Sheriff! Sure, still in there! What are you gonna do, Sid? If we cancel now, it'll be another six months until next launch. God damn it, Sheriff! Sure, you want me to make me a murderer? Captain, Captain, Sheriff. Sure. Tank number seven check com is complete. Once I cl complete tank number eight, it's all clear. Come on, Shira, hurry up, you're gonna die. 30 seconds until ignition, beginning countdown. Sid, forget about her, we won't make it in time. Well, what, what, what am I supposed to do? Fifteen seconds until ignition, internal temperature rising. Man, moon, out of space, my dreams! Ignite engine. Shit! Yeah, yeah, yeah. good. And that's how you do a flashback on the PS1. Hell yeah. He he pushed the emergency engine shutdown switch, aborting the mission to save my life. After that, the space program was cut back, and the launch was cancelled. It's my fault his dream was destroyed. That's why... It's alright. I don't care what the captain says. I'll live my life for him. Woman, you've been doing too much of that shit. Shira, you still haven't served them tea! I-I'm sorry. Hurry up and sit down. Ain't my hospitality good for enough of you? Hey, late. Where's Rufus? Oh, God, this asshole. 
Oh, I don't even remember what voice I did for him. Oh boy. Palmer, weirdo. Hey, hey, a long time no see. So Sid, how you been? Well, if it ain't Fat Man Palmer, how long you figure on keeping me waiting? So, when's the space program gonna start up again? Hey, I don't, I don't know. The president's outside. Why don't you ask him? God, give him for nothing, fat bastard. Don't say fat. Oh God, the wobbling. What the hell is with this guy? Hey, hey, T. Can I have some too, with lots of sugar and honey and oh yeah, don't. Oh, good lord, lard. Okay. I know there's a lot of stuff you put in. You can put in tea. I know some people put milk in it. Mom's fond of that one. I know some people put like butter in there. I mean, what oh, lard? Why? Ugh. Now you make me sad. Oh boy. Oh Palmer, you, you sad, sad little man. Uh, wobbles, but he doesn't fall down. Is he gonna wobble when I pass? Can't pass. Damn it. Disgusting lard tea. See, now I'm gonna be curious about that. Now I'm gonna wanna try that just to make sure I don't vomit. What the? You got me all excited for nothing? What the hell do you come here for? I want to borrow the tiny Bronco. We're going after Sephiroth, but it seems like We've been going in the wrong direction. But now, we think we know where he's headed. But we have to cross the ocean, that's why we want your plane. God damn it, first the airship, then the rocket, now the tiny Bronco. Shinra took out of space for me, and now you want to take the sky away from me, too? Oh my, you seem to forget it was because of Shinra Incorporated that you were able to fly in the first place. What? Uh, excuse me? Uh, this way? I hope she's got a... You wanted to use the tiny Bronco, right? I believe Palmer's going to take it. Why don't you talk to him? Ah, oh, well, there's a... hint and a half. Thank you, game. Ooh. Hmm, why do I have to do this? I'm the head of the space program. Oh god, I didn't see him in the shot. Maybe it's just my screen, but it looks like he has a... Hmm. Looks like he has a red dot where his eye should be. That's kind of messed up. We'll be taking that tiny Bronco. I've seen you somewhere before. I know, the Shinra building, where the president was killed. Uh... Security? Already boss battle, okay. This is the exact opposite. Oh, good lord with that animation. This is the exact opposite of last stream. Okay, nice. Okay. I mean, I kind of wanted to do, do summons, but... I don't want to... Sarmasol! I don't want to... Dump all my MP before things get hairier. Oh man, Vincent's taking a little bit of beating. Uh, next, next Tifa turn. Let's see about heals. Galleon beast. That's just a behemoth, which I'm cool with, but it's like okay. See if I can steal anything. Magic cure two. Yep, Vincent. Oh, nothing to steal. Okay, I didn't even catch if I stole anything. Now I feel like an ass, but whatever. It's fine so long as the. Oh. Oh, seriously. You know I don't typically respond well to taunts. I don't typically respond to taunts, but you know, why not? Watching him dance around like that, for some reason I'm thinking of uh, the old MacGyver show, not the not the new one. 
and uh, Dana Elkar, who played, uh, God, what's, what's his name? Pete Thornton. I'm some, for some reason, I'm thinking of Pete Thornton doing all this shit. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, why can't I even get hit by the propellers? Come on. That nanny nanny boo boo shit doesn't work on me. <laughs> okay. Uh, I can I can live with that. That is that is fine. Would've been cool if it was Sid too, but you know, I'll take what I can get. What? Eden coat? Eden coat? Hmm. It, it won't stop. Forget it. Get in. Did he just Naruto run? Did he just do that? Oh, boy. I mean, I know it was before Naruto. I know that that's been a thing for longer, but damn it. If Naruto didn't popularize that. Uh. Could someone get in the pilot seat? That's... <laughs> right. Holy shit, the legs on Sid! You had the... Shit, the tail's been hit! Emergency landing! There's gonna be a big splash. Hold on to your drawers and don't piss in them. Hmm. Bloop. For some reason, I remember seeing this and thinking they went further out. I don't know. She ain't gonna fly anymore. Can we use it as a boat? Do whatever you want! Sid, what are you gonna do now? I don't know. I'm history with the Shinra. I've given up on the town. How about your wife? How about, how about Shara? <laughs> wife. Don't make me laugh. Just thinking about marrying her gives me the chills. What are you guys gonna do? We're going after a man named Sephiroth. We have to get we'll have to get Rufus of, of the Shinra someday too. I don't know anything about that, but what the hell? Sign me up. How about it, everyone? Of course, no problem. Glad to be aboard, numbskulls. I'm skulls. Yeah. Anyone stupid enough to go up against Shinra nowadays has got to be a numb skull. I like it. So, where are we headed? Rufus was going after Sephiroth where the Oh. I'm assuming that's not Sid saying that one. Whoops. Rufus was going after Sephiroth toward the Temple of the Ancients. Oh wait shit. Damn it, it was him. What? Unclear text bubbles. Really? Where is it? That Temple of the Ancients? I don't know. Some skull kid was telling me that he was headed the wrong direction. So he was off this way. <sighs> Let's just head for land and get some information. Temple of the Ancients, though? The name bothers me. That didn't sound too bad. It's a temple. It sounds safe. So long as it's not a shitty water temple. Damn it, Ocarina of Time. How to fly the tiny Bronco? Okay. Okay to get on, cancel to get off, shallow waters and rivers, okay. And on and off it to the beach. Now the real question is, can I oh, head back to town and get any of those items? Alright, let's see what we got. Oh, okay. So no, no traversal there. Let's land on the beach and we're golden apparently. So it's basically just been rendered a boat. 
it's, I mean, it's kind of cool, but it's really unfortunate. At least for Sid, it's unfortunate. Oh, nausea there. Oh, hey, where are we at? Uh, see that green dot? That looks like my previous vehicle. Oh god, I forgot where the Temple of the Ancients was. I know they said it, and I feel like an asshole. Ah, well, it's kind of my running state, though, so, eh. See, not that way. Oh, boy. Let's see a little ocean voyage here. Oh. Not quite where I was wanting to go. Ah, here we go. Make sure I'm heading along the... Ah. Oh. Well, I guess that's the beach I have to go on just to get on this landmass. This little tiny little nugget up top. That has my interest, too. And that's, I think, Cosmo Canyon. So, mm. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Oh. oh, I didn't even notice how they sort of simulated the curvature of the world. That's kind of cool. Huh. Okay, what are we... What are we doing? Uh... No, oh, there we go. Okay, I was looking for a path. Alrighty. I... And Sid, though, it's like... I remembered him being a shit, and not just because of Machina Bridged, but just damn. So pissed off at, like, the lady for trying to make sure he doesn't explode. It's like... Just wanted to... He just... He just, he just wanted to make his challenger disappear was all. And, you know... Uh, but she had to be all concerned and shit. It's like, wow, that horrible monster. Ah, well... Something to be said for being a little bit overly cautious, but you know. Oh shit, magic. Why am I doing why am I even doing D barrier? Okay. My thing is with her, it's like, you know. It's like why didn't she book? Kill them all. Okay, I didn't think it was actually going to kill them all, but, you know, I'll take it. Oh, man. Let's see, where was I? Uh... Hmm. I don't think it would hurt to really tent right now. Um... Okay, so yesterday in the Armored Core stream, I was, uh... I mentioned briefly that... Oh. Let's tent real quick. Uh, that I watched the first episode of Mobile Suit Gundam, and I've been meaning to do that for years. I don't know a whole hell of a lot about about that series. I mean, it's good stuff. The show's uh, pretty decent. The animation is definitely 70s animation. It is what it is, and music's pretty on um, pretty, pretty emblematic of the time as well. What the hell are these? I mean, okay. They just really hate Cloud. That's cool. I mean, I guess. Um. Okay. Not much love for anyone, but you know that's that's different. Okay, they're not discriminating anymore. But yeah, Gundam. So, first episode of just classic ass mobile suit Gundam. And you know, I kind of want to go through it. I would very much like to finish watching that. Um, thing is, the opening to that show, they they established the war between the Zeon and, was it, Earth Federation, whatever. Ugh, I'm already missing plot points. But, uh, yeah, they establish it, and they show a couple of the uh, Zeon Gundams, the Zakus, uh, drifting into the station, stealthily sneaking in giant battle robots stealthily sneaking in to a highly populated area. I'm like, what? Um, 
so they're they're levitating into the the thing with like no propulsion and shit but that that that's goofy i'll allow that and everything because it's whatever it's giant robot cartoons but the thing that that got me was the fact that you know they're there to do surveillance they're there to do recon and uh one of the dudes they they stop they park their murder bots and one of the dudes gets out and takes his binoculars out and i'm like wait what 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 the heck what okay so Xeon apparently there, there's some big shit in that universe. That's I know that much, but uh Oh shit, I gotta I gotta heal up now. Magic. Cure two, cure everyone. Please hit Vincent if you're gonna hit anyone. Um they're big shit in that universe. Okay, Xeon They're they're putting the they're putting the screws to everyone. And um Apparently they make giant robots that that do not have uh, optics good enough to do what a pair of binoculars can. I'm like, what even are you guys doing? <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Yeah, death blow again. Let's let's try it. Pow. I mean. I don't know a lot, of, a lot about Gundam in the first place. I, I think the most Gundam I ever watched was a couple episodes of Iron Blooded Orphans, and um, like the first and last episode of G Gundam with some little bits in between, and Gundam Wing I watched all the way through. But that was so long ago I don't remember jack shit other than you know, Hiro Yui and his incredibly dramatic ass. Okay, what? Okay, there's a point at the top of this map, and I can't... Hmm... See, I'm not even sure if I'm supposed to get to that point now. Uh, let's see, where's the... Guess around this way? What the... Oh, downtown, here we go. Ah, oh, man. <sighs> yeah, Char Aznable, though. The, the bad guy. Oh, eh. Let's uh, go ahead and summon. Oh, oh, they're about to get wrecked. Oh, that's not good. When's the last time I saved? shit I thought I saved when I started this island there's no way I saved I did not save chat save early save often like the rule with JRPGs and I just I just ah so dumb I didn't get the benefit of grinding they, they, they weren't even that strong enemies I just dawdled too long and just screwed the pooch. Oh, boy. So I'm just going to blitz through this as fast as I can because... Oh, uh, boy. So, yeah, Gundam, though. Gundam Wing, though. That's one of the games I will... I've mentioned before, I believe, that I've, I have in emulated. Um, Gundam Wing Endless Duel was the, the game in question. And... Um, shotgun and seven of those gold things let's see nothing cool here okay but yeah gun and wing endless duel it never came to the states sadly let's uh let's see if we can just skip some of the plot bits i don't know if there's anything cool in the houses i know there were a couple of items in boxes Out of hell with it, I'll find him or not. I mean, uh, that was a bad, that was a bad. So, Gundam Wing Endless Duel. 
solid fighting game um didn't know it was uh, based on the like the same fighting engine as one of the power rangers fighting games i know it felt really good it's a little bit on the slower side um and i was terrible at it there's a full translation patch uh, out for it now as well as i looked that one up because back then i had no understanding of japanese now i have almost no understanding of japanese and would like to learn more so Oh, boy, it's closed. Ah, wait. Yeah, it's closed. Damn it. But, uh... Translations aside, it was a pretty solid fighting game. They have they have nice, weighty sounds, uh, sound effects. Their their movement belies a bit of their weight. Um, it's kind of a shame it's one of those games that didn't come to the States. And I was... I kind of wish... And, and I'm not seeing it as even remotely a possibility. It would wind up on the... Uh, Nintendo Switch Online thing, because they, they have some Japanese games on there. Uh, I'm trying to remember that one they just dropped. They dropped Donkey Kong Country, not going on the Japanese tangent, but, you know, they recently dropped DKC on there, and it was like one I, I've been meaning to check out for a bit. Okay, I guess I need to go see Shara and check that whole plane situation out. Ah... Uh, It's weird though, fighting games on the Super Nintendo, it's like, um, I never really noticed load times in many cartridge games, but Street Fighter Alpha 2 is another fighting game on Super Nintendo. I love that game. It has loading times. It's like, right when it does the round one fight thing, right as it says fight, it just freezes. I'm like kind of amazed. And I always wondered why that game had that, but I never really saw any other fighting games with that. Um, because I also had Ultimate Mortal Kombat three. That was a exchange. See, I bought Ultimate Mortal Kombat three because you know I thought it would be the better purchase, and uh, I was horrible at it. And then my brother bought Street Fighter Alpha two because he knew what's up, and. Uh, Holy shit. Night and day. I mean, I want to say MK3 had more characters and didn't have that loading thing, but it was... Let's see, it's a little bit of a mess. It wasn't like the... Okay. It wasn't like the worst game I've ever seen. But there were some, uh, there were some bugs. Also, notably, that version doesn't have Shiva in it. But there's a code to select Shiva, and you get this busted-ass pixel mess that's, like, near invisible and has some of her moves and breaks the game if it does more than, like, a couple of its attacks. And fatalities are out. Okay. Yeah, let's go with the rocket thing. Ah, boy, this is, this is bad. I should have saved right when I got that plane. Okay. Note to self. Always save when you get kicked back to the map. Always. Ah, uh, boy. I probably need to give uh, Street Fighter V another check. I'm sitting here still thinking about fighting games, because I've been in such a mood for them, but it's like... <sighs> I don't think... I don't think Five's... I think I'm largely done with Street Fighter as a major franchise I want to play. I think I'm... I think I'm leaning more Tekken from now on. Unless they do something spectacular with Six. Street Fighter Six, if they make, they, if they make their next Street Fighter game, they might, they might dazzle me. I don't know. Hmm. All right, let's see this rocket. I'm trying to think of something rocket related, you know, other than rocket raccoon, because I don't know shit about no rocket raccoon. Uh, keep it sort of tangent. Keep it sort of related to the game. Oh boy, where's she at? Okay, Shara in the hole. 
he thinks she's his slave bullshit. And it's like, uh, it's like, can we just agree you both screwed up? It's like you pushed her too hard and she was too over cautious and shit. It's like, come on, people. A little blame sharing, you know? Oh, boy. Also, what's with that carpet? That is, that is the most hideous carpet. It's like, I don't know how that didn't catch my eye on the first entry into the room. This horrid, horrid pattern with that. Okay. Hmm. <sighs> So now the entire scene's kind of gone green, just to rub it in my face, I suppose. Hmm. Oh boy, where are we at? Where are we at? Man, Ubisoft though. Uh, I'm still thinking about that note. They they got their little presentation earlier, and I'm hoping I can actually log in to my Ubisoft account and confirm whether or not I got that, because I did have the stream running for. The minimum one minute it required, but uh, yeah, then a little restart happened, and you know, shit hit the fan. Oh, I hate blitzing through all of this without doing anything. It feels like shit. Uh, one save error. Hopefully, that doesn't happen again for the rest of this run. Ah. Uh. But yeah, I'm trying to think of other Ubisoft games because Watch Dogs, it felt it felt pretty decent. I could get past the driving. Um, the crew, I never tuned a car well enough to really get into it, but that there's something about that game. I really want to get back to it. It really felt because of the amount of tuning can, you can do on cars, but the, the problem is you kind of have to do tuning to the cars and I'm, I'm shit with cars. I know nothing about vehicles. I mean, I, ba I I barely know how to change my own, like, fuel filter. I had to look up how to change my own oil recently. I know nothing about cars at all. Oh, the part where I can't skip because I, I screwed up and didn't save earlier. <laughs> Damn it, game. I love this game, though. I love this game. I talk shit, but I love this game. Ah. Uh. Oh man, Final Fantasy IX, I forgot entirely about it, speaking of Final Fantasy games. I didn't realize it's like turning 20, I think, this month. That game's like 20 years old. Like, mm, I want to play that game so, so much. I want to play it again. I play it. I want to get it on PC. Get one of those um, enhanced texture packs. Can we skip? We cannot skip. Um, Because it... I always liked it back at the time. I mean, this game's got great character designs, too, but, you know, just something about 9 felt to me like... Mm. It might just be the nostalgia goggles, let's, let's be real, but something about the whole package of 9 felt like it had, it had longer to bake, like they knew better where they were going. I don't know. But this game has really good character designs, too. And no, I'm not just talking about Tifa. I like Red 13, too. I like I love Red. I love Red and uh, kind of wish there's a little bit more for him in here. So hooray for the remake. <laughs> Barrett's surly, cranky ass. Barrett's great. Oh, I didn't even notice he had his foot up on the table. It's a little touches. His foot up on the table. On this ugly ass rug. Oh god, Palmer's so gross. <laughs> uh fat man. No, no bombs, sadly. Uh Was that a was that a helipad on the, the big shell? I'm trying to think, because I'm 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 thinking about Metal Gear Bleh. I'm thinking about Metal Gear Solid 2 right now and the the Fat Man fight, because I know there's a rather large fighting arena. Ooh. Oh my god, he's like one of those those little dashboard hula dolls. He just 
the, the wiggling is it's like is you ew, ew palmer <laughs> oh god well this thing can trigger shit oh boy hate blitzing through this because I missed that safe that opportunity to save, but hey, okay. And you'd think though that Rufus, this is something here I'm not not quite getting. Rufus drags his ass all the way out to this town so he can borrow a plane. Did I not see him flying over to another town in a helicopter earlier in the same game? Um, there was an airship advertised at one point. Um, don't they, I mean, they have, like, pretty big-ass murder bots, too. You'd, you'd think that by now... <sighs> I don't know, maybe it's just me, but it seems like... Shinra should have a plane or two. Just, just one or two lying around somewhere, just... I mean, don't get me wrong, Tiny Bronco's cool. You know, I guess real men fly pink, but, uh... Yeah, it seems like a little a little odd that Rufus is going to come out to this little boonie town and just say, Hey, can I borrow your plane? You, you'd, think, you'd think he has a plane for every day of the week. But I didn't paint mine pink. He did, so I have to borrow his now. Oh, hooray! I get to do this fight again. This time I, I nuke him. Nukes! Ah, well, close enough. Uh, let's see, magic. Oh, okay. And summon. Ah, uh, well, I don't have a lot of MP, so why, let's just do it. Pew. Tifa, she's got a summon. I'm just going to stick with that. I'm going to risk missing with death blow. That feels kind of meh. Also, and, and speaking of the plane thing, it's like Palmer's here too. It's like... He's the space guy. You'd think he'd know. He'd be like in the, the the guy with the finger on the pulse of Shinra Aeronautics. So it's like, the hell, Rufus, Rufus would be like, "Hey, Palmer, I'm sure you have a few planes laying around. Mind if I borrow one?" And Palmer would be like, "Yeah." Only if you inject like Crisco directly into my veins, I suppose. Also, oh, that's a, that's such a cool summon. That really is. Eat shit, Palmer. I probably should probably should use a steel here. All right, cure on Vince. Nothing to steal. Okay. Oh boy. I'm at least getting to the part where I have the tiny Bronco and, and have all my shit back. Is that Thunder? Yeah, that's Thunder. Okay. Ah, we were expecting some storms here today. Whereas yesterday it was uh, a little further up north getting the storms. Ah. Oh man, now I want to watch that. What is it? Raiders of the Lost Ark now. Mm. That's probably way off sync for the video, but you know, I'm going by what's, what I'm seeing on my screen, so. Eh. Just. Just like a. Just a field goal with Palmer. Ah, boy. Get that. Kodum, uh, Kodum Bob. All aboard! Won't stop. And propellers don't look like they're doing a lot of going. Okay, okay. 
And Vincent, they're in the danger zone. Shit, if I'd have been thinking, I'd have slapped Barrett on the party for this uh, little misadventure. Ah! Uh. Lower, lower, lower! Oh no, damn. Blue streak speeds by Sid High Wind. Doesn't have the same ring to it. Shit, I should have gone with Jaleel White voice for him. <laughs> God. Hey, right. move, game, game, so I can see. Oh, oh. Oh. That's very weird. Oh! Oh, I did not know that. Ooh. Ah, I was kind of seeing if he could move his cloud in this little bit, bit too. Ah, well. Won't fly anymore. That's quitter talk, Sid. But then again, I think this entire conversation was kind of quitter talk, so I guess it's appropriate. Mm. Oh, boy. Says he's given up on the town, but we all know the answer to that. You'll be back. They always come back. Uh... Man, it's a good thing they have these planes, though. You know, Shinra will never chase them now. They they totally don't have planes of their own. Uh, Rufus, what the hell are you doing with your life? Big old white coat sure isn't a lab coat, because you are no genius. Okay, Temple of the Ancients. Now I gotta... Okay. This is incredibly ill-advised, because I said to myself I'd save it as soon as I got kicked back to the map. Uh, oh, no, I'm right where I need to be. So yeah, I'm going to save as soon as, it, as soon as I got kicked back to the map. Okay, oh boy, where's the thing? Okay, got to get out, I guess. Okay, so this seems to be the weekend for time-wasting. Sorry about all of that. Oh my god, that's embarrassing. But, um... Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and sign off on that note. And next week we'll pick up and I'll keep a little bit better eye on that whole party health thing. Yeah, I forgot a high potions. Oh, well. Maybe duck back to Cosmo Canyon before going live. Uh, this was a stupid session. Should have had more coffee. Anywho, I am going to go ahead and sign off, as I said. Wednesday Zone of the Enders Zone of the Enders Yeah, that's what I'll do And Saturday Back to Armored Core Verdict today With a substantially faster pace Now all that setup shit is done And Sunday back to more Final Fantasy 7 With, you know Some attention paid to Saving Ugh I'm burning so much time with this game. Uh, <laughs> ah, whatever. It's, I still love this game, so it is what it is. So thank you one and all for stopping by. Navigator EX here, and I will see you when I see you later, party people. Hmm? Induce nausea!